Stuart Damon is an American actor. He is known for 30 years of portraying the character Drive, Alan Quatermain on the American soap opera General Hospital, for which he won an Emmy Award in 1999. Outside the USA, he is better known for the role of Craig Sterling in The Champions. Personal life. Damon was born in Brooklyn, New York, the son of Eva and Marvin Leonard Zonis, who was a manufacturer. His parents were Russian Jewish immigrants, making their home in America after fleeing the Bolshevik Revolution. Damon has been married since 1961 to Deirdre Ann Otterwill. They have two children, Jennifer and Christopher, and adopted their grandson, Alexander, in 2000. Acting career, after a series of appearances on Broadway, Damon's appearance as the prince in the 1965 version of Rodgers and Hammerstein's Cinderella starring Leslie Ann Warren helped pave the way to a long career in television and soap opera. The very same year, he had a prominent featured role in the Broadway musical Do I Hear a Waltz, written by Richard Rodgers and Stephen Sondheim. He had earlier appeared in an off-Broadway revival of The Boys from Syracuse with music by Rogers and lyrics by Lorenz Hart. Damon is prominently featured on the cast albums of these musicals, as well as the 1960 hit Hermeladus. Moving to Britain in the 1960s, Damon starred in the hit musical Charlie Girl with Anna Neagle in 1965 and appeared as secret agent Craig Sterling, alongside Alexander Bastardo and William Gaunt, in the cult series The Champions. He also partnered with Roger Moore in an episode of The Saint which has been credited as an inspiration for the later series The Persuaders, with Damon's role being played by Tony Curtis. In 1968 he appeared in the BBC TV adaptation of the £1 million banknote and played the starring role. Damon also played magician Harry Houdini in a lavishly staged London musical, Man of Magic. In the 1970s, he was cast alongside Jean Barry and Catherine Skell in the series The Adventurer, appearing briefly in two episodes. Damon has since spoken candidly about the fact that Barry did not want him in the series because of his height. At over six feet, he towered over the relatively short Barry. After acting roles in several other British television series, including the new Avengers and children's favorite The Adventures of Black Beauty where he played a hypnotist, he returned to the United States. In 1977, he began his most famous American role, that of Dr. Alan Quatermain, Sr., on General Hospital. He also repeated the role on the short-lived G.H. spin-off Port Charles. In 1999, Damon won the Best Supporting Actor Emmy for his portrayal of Alan, a physician addicted to the painkiller hydrocodone. In 2005, Damon was reunited with Alexander Bastardo and William Gaunt for the first time in almost 40 years to provide audio commentary on a DVD release of The Champions. In December 2006, it was reported that Damon had been fired by Jill Farron Phelps on the orders of Anne Sweeney and Brian Franz from General Hospital and his last air date was scheduled for February 26, 2007, when his character died. The reason behind his release was not made public. The taping of the final scene occurred on February 5, coincidentally Damon's 70th birthday. Fellow actors on General Hospital spoke to the press about how upset they were over Damon's firing, with Damon's on-show wife Leslie Charlson saying, This is the 30th anniversary for the two of us, in August. The timing leaves me very discouraged about the way soaps are going. The total disregard for history and the blatant disregard for the veterans, despite the death of the character, Damon had remained on the show, playing the ghost of Alan Quatermain, haunting his sister Tracy about forging Alan's will. He remained with the show until December 23, 2008, when Alan appeared to Monica on Christmas to tell you her that he loved her. On September 18, 2009, Damon began appearing on As the World Turns as Janet and Terry Chicone's uncle, Ralph Manzo, a businessman most likely involved with the mob. 
He left the series on October 30, 2009, but returned for three episodes between August 23, 2010 and August 25, 2010. During March 19-25, 2010, Damon played the role of Governor Jim Ford on Days of Our Lives. Damon returned to General Hospital for two episodes on August 26, 2011 and August 29, 2011 in which Alan appears in a fantasy sequence of monikers. He returned again in November 2012 as a ghost when son AJ was announced to be alive after son Jason's disappearance. He appeared again as a ghost along with Rick Weber and Emily Cortemier for the show's 50th anniversary episode which aired April 2, 2013. Awards and nominations. Works. Broadway First Impressions, 1959. From A to Z, 1960. Irma Lardus, 1960. The Boys from Syracuse, 1963. Do I Hear a Waltz? 1965, West End Charlie Girl, Man of Magic 1968, Television Cinderella 1965, Man in a Suitcase 1967, The One Million Pounds Bank Note 1968, The Champions 1968, The Saint 1969, UFO 1970, The Adventurer 1972, the Adventures of Black Beauty 1973, A Touch of the Casanovas 1975, Thriller, Nightmare for a Nightingale 1976, Yanks Go Home 1976, Space, 1999-1976, The New Avengers 1977. General Hospital 1977 to 2008, 2011, 2012, 2013, Fantasies 1982, Fantasy Island 1983, Legend of the Champions 1983, America 1985, 1986, Silent Assassins 1988, Mike Hammer 1987, Perry Mason. The Case of the Killer Kiss 1993, Me and My Hormones 1996, Port Charles 1997 to 2002, As the World Turns 2009, 2010, Days of Our Lives 2010, Film A Touch of Class, Young Doctors in Love, Star 80, Silent Assassins, Chairman of the Board, Recording Stuart Champion Damon, Reflection Records 1970, 